Well, this is a reunion almost a decade in the making. A tiny dog stolen from a family about 10 years ago is back home tonight. Zania Maldonado shows us the happy homecoming and what made it possible. I peeked in, asked if it was Rex. I got a nod and I instantly knew. Rex the Yorkie finding himself back in the arms of loved ones after he was stolen 11 years ago. Really something we were really hoping that will one day happen. And finally it did. We had to wait a lot, but <laughs> it's, it's amazing. Marzina Najalik says she bought Rex back in 2011 when her younger brother passed away unexpectedly. We were all devastated and I kind of was thinking that maybe getting a dog, and especially Yorkie, you know, will maybe bring some cheer into our family, especially to my mom. You know, I gave her for her birthday, <laughs> that, the dog, and unfortunately it was, you know, it was stolen. Marzina says her dog was stolen minutes after he ran off from their old house here in South Boston. He just sneaked out between the legs when someone was leaving the house <laughs> for, a, for a moment. And we had a witness that someone just pulled over and took him from the, you know, from the street. The family spent months searching for him, putting up posters, offering a reward, and filing a police report. On Wednesday, animal control officer Michelle Carlos found Rex running loose miles away in Stoughton. His microchip leading them back to Marzina, now in Quincy. It was very exciting to have him back, especially that it was a long time. I wasn't even alive two years before I was alive. Marzina adds she lost her other brother just two months ago and calls Rex's return during the difficult time a miracle. Oh my gosh, you know, we got him after, you know, the first tragedy and now he's back after second one, you know, to help us deal with this loss. So that's, that's how it feels like. In Quincy, Zinia Maldonado, WBZ News.